remember the sword and shield dude kicking my ass. Um, was this guy twin axe? Oh my god, that damage! Alright boys, welcome back. Let's continue our run. I barely even remember what our build was. Now we had like some fire going on and some magic potency, yeah. Alright. Lose too much health. Honestly, I'm kind of scared I'm gonna like die immediately. Whenever lucky your attacks inflict a random. Ooh! I have these burning ones though. Increased burning damage. One enemies inflicted by curse. I don't have anything. Oh, wait. <laughs> that sounds sick too. Alright, I'm gonna keep our swords because it works with the burning. I'm gonna get this brooch of the bleeding sun though. That sounds sick. I have too many cards and like... Alright, so I have three slots left. I can get rid of... What can I get rid of? I don't even know. Maybe the magic potency? Might have been a grief to play that earlier. I'm not sure what the final build is going to look like. If we even make it there. Hopefully these three cards from these camps will let us decide. What is that thing back there with that massive sword? Is it just a dude? Yeah, it is. What the fuck? He's huge, dude. So many, I just I can't keep track of them all. Thank God the burning is doing work. Good God. Um, gotta have in the room. Can I even open this though? I can't. Let's see here. Not gonna be playing that. I'm set on mana, dude. The bone needle. Ah, oh, the hunter's figure is so nice, but fuck it, we're not using it. Even though we have that frenzy thing. Maybe I should have done a side quest first. Never lucky and low on health. Taking damage will heal you. What? It's nutty. Take another bone needle, I guess. All vendor prices are reduced. I'll take the health thing. That saved us uh, the first time we killed the boss. And I can't even... Can I remove? I think I'm going to remove this magic potency. Let's do it. I assume that's like my little X move and I never use it, so I'll play this, I think. I want to play one of these cool... This is just going to increase our weapon damage by so much though. I'm doing that. Almost doubled that shit, alright. Do not need more mana. I'll be using it. Oh yeah, I just beefed it up.
I really want to get that explosion one active. It sucks. We don't have anything to like gain the uh the little blue bar really. Dude, if I had it right there, all these dudes would have exploded. This posture impact for forceful attack. I do want to go, um... I'll just play this immediately again. I do want to go some type of forceful build with like a long sword. Maybe that's what I'll try to do next run. What is it? Why does it have so much? Oh my god. Critical skin bleeding. Enemies consume the bleeding and deal increased damage. Another sender. <laughs> do we want to. Nah. Are they. We have enough. They all end up burning pretty quickly, anyways. I'm actually gonna drain that. Ooh, I will take those coins immediately. I'll wait till we clear this camp though. I don't even know if that's enough to buy a single slot, but I need money bad. I gotta remember to use my special attack too. What is that? I don't remember these. Yeah, that's definitely a new enemy. Okay, these guys don't seem like the problem that they were before. They were horrendous. Ooh, while Surge is active, increase magic potency. Next against bleeding, I mean, inflict weakness. Ooh. We have, what do we have? Crits have 30% chance. What is this potted? Okay, if I play that. I've never played that before. How the fuck do I find it? More coins. More slots. Um. I have no idea how I'm meant to find that pot. I don't know how that works. If it's like... Should I be able to see it in this vision? Um... Could Google it, but what's the fun in that? What is... What is that? That was just glowing. Serious magic symbols. Okay, yeah. Who cares about the lore, dude? Little gold from the trolls. Classic. This dude's gonna beat my ass.
do enough stagger damage to even drown them, only using heavy attacks. Oh no. Increase the mana cost of a random card. Which one did it hit? Not bad. Didn't realize we were full. Or we used all of our uh, blessings. I gotta remember that's a thing. For the money Ooh, and the sigil key. I'm actually not even gonna bother checking the. What is that? Is that glitched? Oh my god, I just had to fix it. It's blowing out my eardrums. 180, 229, 259. If I could find that pot, it's not these, right? No. What are we gonna play? Definitely wanna play that just because I wanna see what it looks like. Do I wanna do Cinder Brace? Our armor's already. I feel like it's. I'll play another Bone Needle. Oh damn, it increased that card cost. That's unfortunate. Alright, so I just looked it up. It's a ri Oh, it's literally right here. I paused the game, googled it, and saw that... There it is. I thought you're supposed to find a rainbow. Well... Don't mind if I do. Let me go buy that last slot. Unfortunately, we're losing, we're losing damage every time I play this shit, though. From all the cards we pulled. Wait, how much does it cost? Is healing still 50? Please tell me it is. I should have checked. Fuck, no, it's not. Damn. Um, I'm just gonna play this other bone needle. I know we're gonna lose. Oh, we still gain some. Okay. If we can get our cards back up, this talon, that'd be optimal. I can't heal, so I imagine I'm gonna have to use that, um, the lost health thing. What is this? Oh, shit. Hatred level reduced by one. I don't even know what our hatred level is. But we will hold on to that card. I don't really know what I would switch out on our build currently. Now. If I remember correctly, this one was a bitch, and I hated doing it. Thumbnail? Let's take a thumbnail, because this is where we perish. Something like that, we'll find it. Somewhere in there is a thumbnail. I remember the sword and shield dude kicking my ass. Alright, we have one heal. Okay. So close. There we go, he's staggered. Oh, that looks sick. I haven't seen the um. I gotta pay attention to my health.
Um, didn't pay attention to my health. All right, this time we went Great Weapon Master and Prey on the Weak. So Prey on the Weak is a little different now. Hello? Please go to the right. Oh my god. There we go. Text against enemies at least half their posture broken has 11 increased weapon damage. I mean, it's not that much, honestly, but it's decent. Then we got great weapon for the um, posture damage as well. Forceful attacks have increased posture impact, so I'm hoping we get something going with posture. That's the plan. Now, restart something we don't. Why not? Let's go this one. Nothing like dying to the first boss. So nice, I don't have to go to this bird. Let's um let's get the mana first before we go in there. Oh, it's these little shits. Oh my god. These guys didn't set you on- oh wait, he was probably an igniter, huh? Just didn't notice. Ooh. I'm gonna take that, actually. Hold off the play it, but... I can get some, uh... One meditates with that. Test out like all the weapon executions. Increase damage by devastating attack. Yup, we're taking that for sure. I'll hold off too. I'll keep looking for a meditate. We can get some posture damage, devastating attack going. Let's see how much damage is possible to do to a boss with that shit. chest open <laughs> what the hell that's kind of cool actually but I'll be taking that shield got the posture all these cost so much take more mana forgot we are playing the wolf though all our extra cards will be Extra damage once we figure out our weapon. If I can find, what is it? I think Ranvig's Crownbreaker. I've never seen it. And it's slightly different from what it used to be, but still basically posture damage, I'm pretty sure. They just die before I even get a chance to break their posture. I like stab him in the legs or like dick height. Uh, 
Uh, what do I? I mean, I don't really want to finish with that. Should I take a sharpen? I don't plan on using that armor till the end, so I feel like it's kind of not the best idea to take it right now. Magic potency. So I want to go a magic potency build as well. Wait, what is this? Hold up. What are you? Oh. Mana gained. Mana gained doubled for next mana card played. Oh shit. Luck increased by 15 to legendary card. You have 50% discount on vendors until your next purchase. Ooh. Damn, I wish I would have checked the vendor. The mana. We could gain four from one of these. They have... I'm gonna take the discount. I'm gonna chance it. If they have something decent, like Ranvigs or an armor that works for the posture shit. It'll be a play of the century right there. Just a slayer here? It is not just a slayer. Where'd you just go? Hello? It's not fair. Dude flew on my ass. Hmm. When using a forceful. I'll do that. Forceful is this, right? I assume. And that one's not free. I'm not even gonna pull it. I have one blessing remaining still though. Wait, did they not? Yeah, they only dropped one. Let me... What we got here? Let's kill these fuckers. Wow, just spin the wind. Look at this shit. Oh my... The fuck are you? Three second enemies with a long sword and a single very hard camp. Well, I don't know what that thing was, but let's um. Get our mana. Ooh. Increased damage when using. Oh, dude, I kind of want the hook, but the posture damage. Oh, what do I do? Taking the hook. Let's use the shield charm and the hook. Meditate would have given clutch right there. Where's the shop here? There you go. Alright, um, not that one, forceful attacks, alright, it could work, definitely not that, next against frozen enemies deal 1000% increased weapon damage, but immediately ends a frozen. I don't really want to, 
I'm not going to. I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save that card that we played. Let's go straight to the boss. We have no blessings. We have two mana. I'm not gonna use increased damage when using forceful. Uh, fuck it. We can throw that on before we do this, I guess, too. We're gonna be using a dueler thumbnail. Ooh, right there, he looks spooky. Alright. Was this guy twin axe? Yeah, like I said, I'm not confident with like any of these dudes. Besides the fire guy. Lock on. Oh my god. Oh my god, that damage. Oh fuck, I should have charged that better. God. Yo, posture is fun. That dude didn't stand a chance. Ooh, dude, I'm excited to see where this goes. Also, I forgot about the speedrun shit. Perfect Garden Flick Sport. Don't remember what that does. While Surge is active, secondary aerial t attacks deal 150 earth damage in a line. When enemies afflicted with sport weapon damage and Damn dude. I don't really I want to see what that ability is, but I don't have any armor yet. I was gonna take this for the armor. Our weapon's fine right now, even though I wanna see what that looks like. Plus zero. Free armor, why not? What's this shit look like? Ooh, that's a thumbnail right there. Attacks against wait, what is this? While series active, your perfect dodge spawns a spore trap. There's so much shit I don't remember. My perfect guard inflicts. Should I keep this? Oh, I don't know. Just have these two things working with each other? Or health by 40%. Fuck it, I'll try the leaf. We'll play that and we'll try to keep this armor. Alright boys. I'm gonna end this episode here. Since we died to that first boss. Let's go. Look at the ice next. Do shit we don't usually do. And I will see you boys in the next part. Thanks for watching.